Balls! Ladies and gentlemen, balls. I can't even believe it. We found some balls. Dude, this is it. This what is, is up the world? What up, peeps? It is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here. Hanging out today, doing stuff and things. Back with some more Stranded Deep. And ladies and gentlemen, I have big news. I have big, big news. Well, first of all, we're going to pop our potatoes out of here. Because we can make fuel with rotten potatoes, I'm pretty sure. So we want to get a bunch of them. So it doesn't matter if these guys spoil. We're going to go ahead and put them over here. But big news, guys. You ready for this? It's, it's quite a thing. I, today, are you ready? I got on. I started playing some video games here. You know what I mean? Because video games are like a thing that I do sometimes. Sometimes I'll play a video game. And I did not have to restart. It was amazing. I couldn't believe it. I know. I know. It was the most amazing thing that ever happened. I did not have to restart the game. I am here with all my stuff. I have my piles. Look, I need food. I need to drink. It's like a real game. I can't even believe it. Ah, oh, so, so exciting and so excited to be back. Thank you guys so much for coming to hang out with me. Make sure if you like this video, don't forget to show your support. Hit the thumbs up button if you'd like to see. If you'd like to see more Stranded Deep. Uh, if you're new and you have a good time, subscribe for more. All right. So first episode, we had a great time. Second episode, we started again. Third episode, we started again. This episode, no. <laughs> we have a working base area place, and we are not starting again, I hope. I literally, seriously, when I woke up today and I got onto the PC here and I started to play this game, I thought to myself, wouldn't it be just the most awful thing of all time <laughs> if I had to restart again? All right. So... We got some stuff and things. Now, I think these guys are all empty, uh, but we brought a bunch of stuff back with us. I don't think we, we don't have any more balls. We don't have any more things. I do want to go ahead and do something over here, though. I'm feeling like I don't know if I have enough six to do this, but I'm feeling like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Oh, wait. <gasps> I don't have a hammer. Oh, you guys. You know what we're going to do? All right. First order of business today. We're going to have to make a couple of changes to the raft. Oh, also, I wanted to talk to you guys about your proposed names for said raft. We had a lot of good ones. We had the SS Brenda, of course. Brenda is the perfect name for any schooner. I don't know about any boat. Any schooner? Dude, mall rats reference, check. A schooner should be named Brenda. Uh, what else do we have? The SS Kevin, not a bad idea. The SS Lipgator. I should probably put the sail down. I'm drifting. Dude, the wind. This is like a real sail deal. Let's go like so. Let's go like so. And then I heard, oh, yeah, you can change the way that the uh, sail faces with Q and E. That was another amazing comment that you gave. But I'm not really sure why we do that. I don't know why, because I feel like the sail just works just as good, regardless of which way it's facing. But anywho, so the SS Kevin, the SS Brenda, the SS Lipgator, Unsinkable 2. A lot of really, really good names. The Minnow, the SS Don't Make Me Restart. That was a good one as well. But I feel like what we're really going to do here is go with one I really like. Now, this person may have spelled this a little bit weird, but I'm going to go with it. The Sea Gator. Ladies and gentlemen, the unbelievable and amazing, <clears throat> unbelievable and amazing Sea Gator. Because it is kind of like a sea. Dude, the sail moved on its own again. Does it do that by itself? Did I do that by accident? So, it, oh, I think maybe because I was holding. Yeah, when I was trying to get out, I was holding E. When I was trying to disengage the rudder. And so that sail moved. All right. So, yes. The Sea Gator. I love it. I like the idea. You know, it makes me think of a gator. Even though Slip Gator doesn't have anything to do with alligators. But anyway. Uh, and what we're going to do to start off with today is just head over to this island. Now, I know I hadn't, I haven't brought anything. I didn't bring any crates. What are you doing, Slip? You haven't brought any of the things you're going to need. Well, the real reason we're coming back over here. Uh, the main reason is just for... I think we le left a couple of hammers. And, uh, well, there is... You know what? I don't know if I can stop at this... Deal. Did we actually do this deal already? Or is it too far out? I think maybe we didn't. I'm wondering, I have an idea, and I'm wondering, does the sea anchor work like way out here? Let's take a look and see. If I'm way, way out. Oh, dude, there's a shark. Well, it'll be a good test anyway. We're way out over here. Does it work? Dude, I feel like it does work from this distance. Dude, great. Oh my God, amazing. Dude, barrel, I need a hammer. Okay, now we have... Oh, oh, there he is. Oh, no, 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 don't touch me! So, uh, all right, hold on. Pop up here. Now, can we just set this guy down? I don't know if anything's changed. Okay, we can just set it down. Whoa, shark. Okay, I'm going in. Now, I feel like... No, we haven't been in here yet. This is excellent. 
Oh, what? Nothing. Two nothings? Wait, did we? Have we? I'm so confused. There we go. Well, fuel tank deal. Anything in the front? Nothing in the front? Let's pop back over this way and head back out. All right, I will call this success. Now, uh, there were some barrels up front, and I kind of want to use those, but I think we can do that on our way back a little bit. We're going to unanchor, and then, oh, yeah, just slide right on by. Just slide right on by, homie. I got, just, what are you doing? Why? Why? No. Hard to left. Okay, we're stuck. Maybe? No. No. Okay. No. Oh, the little deal moved. All right, we're a little bit stuck. Okay, it's no problem. We're a little bit stuck. I'm just going to pop in here like so, and then I'm just going to squirt this guy around like this. Okay, we're back on. All right, bam. Grab this guy. Grab it. Operate. Hard to port. It's not the most responsive Sea Gator ever. I feel like moving the sail way over really, really helped. But uh, it is a Sea Gator. You know what I mean? It's not the best Sea Gator, but it's our Sea Gator. It's the one we deserve. All right. So let's pop over here. Let's go ahead and unrudder and then pop up here and drop anchor. There we go. All right. So we left some. I thought we left some hammers. Dude, three hammers. One, two, three. Ah, ah, ah. Awesome. We got a crate. Let's pop this guy down and take a look. Ooh, not importante. Uh, spears this is over here like so. And then a torch that we'll never use. Let's place that down over here. So, uh, we got a couple of those guys. Also, what I want to do. No! I need a lashing. Oh, wait. I have a nut kniffy right here. You know what? We'll leave this one. We'll grab that one. Uh, I want to go ahead and skin these guys up. Let's get that guy going. And, uh... A couple other changes that I want to make to the raft here. So let me see here. We got our crab meat. It looks like we have to do multiples. And we're going to have to head back to base really quickly in order to get this guy going. All right. We got that guy and this guy. All right. So I want to make one more flotation deal. But in order to do that, I'm going to need a lashing, which I don't think we have any over here. We have another crate right there. And we have another crate right here. So I'm going to take that guy. I'm going to grab this. I'm going to grab that. I'm going to make this. Whoa. I'm going to make this. I can't make a lashing. Only three. Why? Open that guy back like so grab that guy there now we can make a lashing oh and the plank scrap obviously very important you know what let's go ahead and get a little organized here real quick okay so very quickly i've got a little bit more organization and i grabbed some stuff from around in the area here but what we're gonna do now is go ahead and grab this guy as well i think and then let me see here if we go like that we have one space left so, no, not, not what we want to do at all. Let's pick up our anchor. Let's go ahead and get this guy back out to the raft again. Because what I want to try to do... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, dude, that was super weird. What I want to try to do... Oh, crap, I want a cracker. Uh, zerp, and then turn. Whoa, 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 whoa. Dude, this is so fast. Ooh, I don't know if we're going to be able to make it over there. I don't think we have enough turnitude. Turnability. What I want to do is get towards the front, drop anchor, and then I'm going to build another flotation deal. Oh, dude, this is going to be perfect, I think. We're going to get right up to it. Nice, this is good. Like so. Like so. Okay. Where is it? Right there. All right. So check this out, man. We're just going to go like this. Now, there's a shark around here, but we're going to try to be really, really careful and really, really fast. Barrel, deal, hammer. See? This guy. Bang. Over here. I want it right in the front. He's done it, ladies and gentlemen. Did that work? I feel like I've done it. All right. Sweet. So we made a little front deal. It's exactly what I wanted to do. All right. And we got our hammers. Dude, we got a bunch of stuff and things. No, not like that. There we go. All right. Hard to starboard. Back to home base. On the SS, no, not SS, <clears throat> on the Sea Gator. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a terrible disaster problem. This did not attach. I can't believe it. It actually didn't attach on when I placed it. You were there, we placed it together, but I don't think it attached. And I don't know if there's a way to get it back, but there were, uh, it wasn't allowing me to uh, steer. <laughs> I couldn't steer to port. I kept going in circles. And I was like, what the hell's going on, man? Why, keep, why do I keep going in circles? So I went and checked the front of the raft, thinking maybe something was up. And it ended up that that barrel base, or that, yeah, whatever it is, uh, was not attached. So I'm going to head back over to this island. We're going to try to affect repairs. <laughs> Good morning. Up at the ass crack of dawn. It is 5.30 in the morning, and I've been working out, guys. I've been working on uh, lifting this ginormous raft. Uh, and I feel like I'm getting pretty good at it, man. Uh, I'm not sure how much it weighs. I'm assuming maybe like, uh, I don't know, seven, 800 pounds. Uh, but it ain't no thing for me, man. I've been working out. I've been lifting the weights. Creatine. Dude, let me tell you about some creatine. This is what it does to you, man. It gives you super unbelievable and amazing power. You know what else is amazing? It gives you power in the morning. It makes you super excited. G Fuel. Yeah, that's right. It's fuel for gamers and grandfathers. All right, let's go ahead and drop that guy. No, raft. Come back. Come back. I, oh, I can swim faster than my raft. I feel like I can do it. Ah. Uh, 
And then I think it'll like teleport me. <laughs> we're here. All right, there's our main island. This is the island we're gonna go to. So uh, off to a new island, you guys. And I brought a couple things with me. I brought a hammer and I bought three planks. Uh, because what I'm assuming we're gonna find on this island is a lot more crates, possibly flotation stuff and things that we can actually attach to the front of the raft. Uh, and a bunch more resources. Now, uh, over on that island there, we still have a lot of wood that we can harvest, which we're going to need. I really want to build our base up. What are you doing? Dude. Leave me alone, man. I'm just trying to hang out. Sh uh, shark. Is that, is that your name? Jeff? Might be Jeff the Shark. I feel like that's his name. Jeff, leave me alone, man. I'm trying to go over there. But anyway, over there, we got a lot of wood. I really want to work on building our house, but we still need a lot of resources, man. We're low on fibrous leaves. We're low on rocks. We're low on wood. We're low on all the things. But I want to just get one more flotation on the front of my raft and then uh, build that up and then put crate storage just on the very front, just for three. Why am I? We riding the wave down? That was amazing. Uh, so I want to get that up and running just so that we can get, you know what I mean, a few more crates when we go out and do stuff and things. I feel like what I want to do is put crate storage uh, on here, just one, uh, and then maybe one here and one here when we get some more planks. So there's going to be a couple. There's going to be a few. Um, and then now, you know, the other thing we got to start talking about or thinking about is kind of exploring further away than one island. You know what I mean? Eventually, that's going to have to become a thing. We still, I think, have one or two islands that are within one island of our starting island. So drink every time I say island. Uh, but yeah, so that could be a thing in the future where we start moving on. But for right now, this is going to be good. All right, so there's our main island. The first order of business we get here is going to be, uh, well, you know what? We could just, mm, no, maybe we won't. I was going to say we could just anchor right over here right now and check that guy out. But I think that what we're going to do first just go ahead and come in for a landing here, and then what we'll do... Let's make sure there's no poisonous stuff and things around here. All right, this, this looks pretty good. Drop that guy right there. I uh, brought an axe with me. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and build a shelter. Uh, I'm going to point that shelter towards our home island, and then we'll explore and see what we can see over here. Eight days survive, ladies and gentlemen, and the storm rages on new island number three. Dude, we're already full of stuff and things. All right, so uh, this is a giant crab island. I did find one of them. You know what, you two guys, I don't know what you're doing over here. Looks like you're doing some sort of something, something. Maybe you guys are making a TikTok. I don't know, what do the kids do these days? I feel like they're TikToking all the time. Oh yeah, there he is right there. Oh yeah, you think you got what it takes? You're stupid and dumb. You're stuck. Dude, he was making a TikTok too. Didn't even notice me come up behind him like that, buddy. All right, uh, let me maybe go like so, and then I can grab him. All right, so, uh, yeah, so far it looks like it's just a crab island. I've still yet to find in the game any snakes or any boars. So I feel like they might not be a thing anymore. Um, I don't know. That's just my guess. But we have a bunch of planks going on here. We still have got to explore a bunch of these wrecks. But what I'm going to do, you guys have seen this stuff and things before, man. We just explore. We find all the things. I'm going to go ahead and fast forward a little bit here and uh, just take care of getting some gathering done. And uh, then I'll be our bees, peeps. Balls! Ladies and gentlemen, balls. I can't even believe it. We found some balls. Dude, this is it. This is our beginning. This is the, the one extension. This is going to be the completion of the Sea Gator once we get these balls. Now, we are silently escaping the balls. Dude, escaping the balls is a good name for a band. Two, three, four, five balls is also a good name for a band. Uh, so, we got our balls. Uh, we got all sorts of friends around as well. Little friendos everywhere. You guys, this is Leather Island. I have found so far three leather on this island. It is freaking amazing. Now, I don't think there's anything in the bottom of this wreck. We could, I don't know if I can see down inside of there. Also, you know something else about this game? You know what would be amazing? There's like seaweed for days down here. Why can't we use seaweed? Make it a little bit more rafty. All right, I don't see or hear, pardon me, a shark that's out here. Oh, inventory is very full. Hold on, we have way too many balls. Uh, oh, it looks like, is that another crate? No, I'm pretty sure I already got that guy over there. Are we good to go? Yeah, th that guy's good to go. All right, you guys, I feel like we're ready to do this, man. Let's go ahead and head over. We got a rock in our inventory? Cool, we can grab this other rock that I just found. Uh, and we have some piles going. But yeah, I found like three leather. Uh, let me also take a look here. Water, mm, we might need a solar still if we're gonna hang out. You know, a way to, to carry water with you would be amazing in this game. And I don't know if there really is such a thing. I mean, we can make the, the like coconut uh, deal, but I don't know how much water that really gives you. Kind of seems like, unrealistic with all of the plastic that you would be finding around in the world 
uh, there would be massive, massive amounts of it that you wouldn't be able to uh, make something to carry water around with you. All right, let's grab those guys. Nothing inside of there. All right, let's put this guy down over here like so. Zerp, and then zerp. I want those to lay flat. Feels good, team. All right, look at this, man. Three leather. I also found, oh, four leather. Two potatoes. A lot of flashlights we don't need, so that's good. Uh, another fishing spear deal. I killed two giant crabs. You guys, I've been busy, man. I'm doing stuff. All right, that guy over there like so. And then now we need to find the elusive hammer. Dude, where did I put the elusive hammer? Hello? Hammer. Bam, he's hammering him. Grab it. Do that. Grab that lashing. Bam, he's done it. Like over that over there, over here. And then uh, let us go into vehicles. And then that guy. Can I attach it on the front from right here? Oh, come on, man. You know you want to attach. Dude, seriously? All right, maybe it won't allow it. Let's go ahead and raise the anchor. No, let's lower the sail. Or raise the sail, pardon me. I, I don't want you to float out too far. It's still not working. All right, maybe we'll try this over here like so. What would be amazing is if you could just build it. Uh, Dude, I don't think it'll build. What the crap? I can't attach. Dude, the game is bugged. This game, is, oh, they're attached over there. Wait, that is really odd, but it won't attach over here. It may be that what happened when I did the front one is it actually like got bugged out or somehow maybe? I don't know. I don't think it's because of the anchor. I've built this structure the way I'm trying to build it now before I've done it, but it definitely won't attach. That is super, super strange. My buoy ball scrap has drifted away. It'll be lost forever. I don't think that I've actually had a problem with that. Yeah, I know, no, I know, I know. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I grabbed all my buoy balls. There must be buoy balls somewhere that are floating away in the in the map. But anyway, all right. I know. I know. How many are... Dude, this game, experimental mode, it's bugged again. All right, I thought we were past this, but it doesn't look like we are. And I understand it's dark, but I want to show you this. I can attach this guy to here. I cannot attach it to either over here or here. I thought maybe it was the anchor, so I pulled that off. And of course, we, I, no, I know, the buoy ball scrap. Mm -hmm, I'm aware of it. No, I know about that. I know. I've, uh... No, I know about it. Oh, really? Is there buoy ball scrap that's floating away? Is that happening? What do you guys think? Is there any more, do you think? Oh, yeah, there's more. <laughs> so anyway, I can't place this guy here. It's just, I can't place it in the middle. I don't. I have no idea why. I've tried everything. I've tried putting it in deep water. I've tried pulling it out of the water completely. I can attach it there. I can attach it there. I can attach it here. I just can't attach it here. And I can't attach it here. So I, I, there's no way for me to like load up an old save or do anything like that. So uh, it looks like it is what it is. Let's go ahead and pop into our vehicles and talk about where's our hot anchor right there. Six stones and four lashings. So we got almost nothing back from breaking it. So I think we're going to have to grab a bunch of these guys. All right. Is that enough in order to build this guy? All right. So I'm just going to go ahead and put the anchor back on. I can put the anchor on. Dude, isn't that odd? That is so weird. I'm gonna try I'm trying to like really make sure there's no like that guy snaps No snap no snap 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 dude. I can snap it everywhere where I need it All right, so we're just gonna put our anchor over here Like so and we're gonna just redesign the raft. So what I'm gonna do is put this guy back in the water ish uh, Go back in there big guy. I know you're big 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 raft I hope I don't step on anything poisonous because that would be a terrible disaster all right, and what I think we're going to try to do is we're just going to add a couple more deals to the back here. So maybe like this. Bam! All right, so that guy's right there. Drop anchor. Yoinkie's done there. All right, so we'll do that. We'll add two more to the back here, and then maybe that's where we'll put our storage for our crates. So I feel like it's a thing. We're just going to have to work. You know what I mean? We're going to have to work with it. Uh, but yeah, under cover of darkness, let's take a look here. Water is not good. Oh, man. Should we build a solar still while we're here? We have a lot of gathering to do. I kind of feel like we should. So that means we're going to need a lashing. We're going to need a coconut. Where are you at, coconut? Grab that guy. Make one of these bad hombres. New plan. I planned it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. What? And a lashing? What's happening right now? Yeah, that's right. I'm going to build another one of these guys. We're going to do it the old school way. Like so. And then it's going to want me to go vehicles uh, like this and like that. We're going to place this guy on this side. Where are you this side? Dude, where am I even? Bam, just like that. And then all we need are four more sticks. 
And that should be the end of this little adventure here. One, two, three, four. Well, not the end of our adventure, but the end of uh, working on a raft deal. I think this is uh, going to be all that we're going to need for the time being. So what we're going to do now is pop us out of here and go like that. Bam! Now what I want to do is... Does it show me there? No, no, no. We go into building and then... No, crafting. That guy right here. Corrugated shelf, baby. I want you to be there. Nailed it! Aced it! Can't be stopped! So now we can put three of these uh, containers and just attach them to the raft. Now I have only, I think, two plank scrap left. So if I want to do another one, I need to find another plank scrap. So not something I'm necessarily super worried about right now. But what I think we're going to do next, because like I had said, I really want to work on our base back at the main island, is uh, now that we have that going, um, and we're not necessarily able to build another container shelf on it at the moment, uh, it's time to deforest this bad boy. Let's tear down as many trees as we can, fill up the raft and all of our storage with a bunch of wood, uh, and bring that all back to our main base area so we can do a little bit of building. I think we're ready to call it, you guys. One, two, three. These guys are all full with palm stuff and uh, wood and all of that. So we're going to go ahead and attach those three guys right there like that. Then I want to grab this and this. Let's go ahead and get our hand out. And then we got water in there. I'm going to put the rest of these fronds inside of here. What kind of water are we looking at here? Maybe we'll drink a little bit of that guy. I want these. Dude, we have a lot of stuff to bring with us, man. Wait, everything? Yeah, all of those are full. I want those. I want so much. <laughs> I want my potatoes. I need my leather. I need these. How much space we got left? Dude, there's not a lot left, man. Uh, what else do we want to really bring with us? I think I have enough wood back at base. Uh, not wood. I think I have enough um, food back at base. I don't need anything like that. Rocks would be really good. One, two, three, four of those. I kind of want to bring my hammer. Dude, I need more planks. So we have hammers back there. Oh, no. We need to cool down. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Dude, I have a lot of Pippi back at base, too. I feel like the corrugated scrap is where it's at. Those guys, like that. And then, nope, that's what I'm trying to do. Hand. Okay. Uh, Maybe we take... Maybe we just eat that. Whatever. We'll just eat the rations. All right. We have found all the things. I have explored all the wrecks. This is the last uh um, of this island we really need to worry about. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and pop this guy back over this way. What way does that face? Where are you? Oh, wait. This guy faces that guy. All right. So there's our island right there. Let's go ahead and raise the sail. Lower the sail, I said. Let's go ahead and lower the sail. Are we moving? No, we ain't moving, man. All right. Let's drag her back out. Come on, Sea Gator. Back to home base, baby. Ah, the Sea Gator coming in to home base. Let's go ahead and do this, man. Let's pop over here like so. Make sure nothing's going to poison us when we stop. Going. All right, so any more potatoes? Nice, two more potatoes, crew. Excellent. Uh, we can go ahead and put those away over in this area here. It looks like we got some lashings that respawned. Yeah, so very, very cool. Hold on, let's pop it inside of here, and then like that, and then put three potatoes. Wait, what? Did I just do that? No, yeah, it's five potatoes we got now, man. Whoa, wait, what? Did I Six potatoes? Ah, ah, ah. Amazing, dude. Six potatoes. So those are very, very valuable. We're going to be able to turn those into fuel when we make our engine uh, and change over the boat to uh, power power as opposed to wind power. Let's drop these guys down over here. We got a couple more planks. Dude, I feel like what we should do is grab that guy and let's go ahead and just grab one of our hammers. And let's pop over here and build one more of our storages on the back on this area here as well. So we've really kind of outfitted ourselves. You know, today we kind of just went and explored another island, which we've done before. There wasn't really anything necessarily super amazing about it. Uh, and that's okay. Like, that happens sometimes. We have to do a lot of exploring. Uh, let me go ahead and go into oh, yeah, crafting, and then that guy, and then that guy right here. Bam. Nice. So three container or two container shelves now. We can grab all these. Hey, there's, not, there's no need of it. Get out of here, man. No one cares. Get you son of a... All right, let's go over this way. So more potatoes. Everything's going good with that. Oh, you know what else, man? Dude, there's so many things to do. I do really like how this is kind of like, you know, it's like a real-life sitch. We got stuff to do. We got palm fronds to put in. We got potatoes to water. I think what I'm going to do actually is build two more potato plots at least. I might even do four more plots over there um, so we can have a really, really high number of potatoes. We don't have to worry about fuel. But right over here, man, dude, cloth, more of that stuff. We got the leather right there. 
Dude, so much leather now for high-end axes. More corrugated scrap, which we can use to make uh, more plots over there. We didn't use it before, but we will in the future. And then more crates. Crates for days? You guys, look at it all, man. So many things. So, yeah, building a bigger base is going to be important. And what I think we're going to need to do in order to get to that next level is start doing plank scraps. Or, pardon me, a plank station. So that we can start making planks so we can make more crates. So I want to extend this out, build it into a second story, and make that really, really large. Uh, also, if you're wondering what this is, this is the palm frond grouping, like the, the whole frond, as opposed to pulling it apart. And it's way easier to bring back that way. It's actually a little bit more efficient to do it like that. So we'll bring those guys over there. But yeah, we're going to need a plank station so that we can go ahead and start making tons of uh, the crate storage units and put those in the base and get all these piles organized. That's going to be my next order of business. And then after that, I feel like it's time to start doing some hardcore exploring, really getting out into the ocean and seeing what's going on. You know, in this game, remember, the reason we're doing our playthrough, I mean, we've played it before. We know a lot about Stranded Deep, but I've never really done any of the boss battles. We've got to go check out what's going on with these boss battles. Uh, I want to do that as kind of like an after all of the other things normally we would do. Normally in Stranded Deep, we build the base and get storage organized and all that and explore around. But now boss battles, man, we definitely got to check that out. And then the end game island, we definitely got to check that out as well. So check it out, man. What a beautiful little sunset here. Our sunset? What a beautiful little moonrise. <laughs> so, yeah, very, very cool. Went to a new island, got a bunch of new crap. And like I said, in the next episode, you guys, a flurry of activity. So make sure if you like this one, don't forget, show your support. Hit that thumbs up button. Big shouts to everybody who helps support the channel on Patreon. You guys are amazing, and you help us in these trying times. Um, and I just appreciate everything you guys do. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you had a good time and made the stuff and things be with you.